Well, good morning, beloved. This is your girl, Sharon, once again from my front seat. And here I am giving God all praise, honor, and glory for what you say, beloved, for this brand new day. So here we are. Today is Saturday. I think this is the 17th of September 20 and 22. And we're giving God all praise, honor, and glory for what you say, beloved, for this brand new day, of course. Well, I am at the, I think it's called Express Car Wash in San Bernardino. I'm on the corner of E and Rialto Avenue downtown San Bernardino so you all know my chicken saga story so um, this morning I come to the car wash open up the door and the uh, gentleman says uh, ma'am what does that smell I smelled it clear from over there I said oh I left a raw chicken in the car he says well did you throw it away I said I did on Tuesday but this was the first day I had to come to get my car washed I'm working from home now thank the Lord and so I haven't really been in my car yet. And actually today was the calmest day that the dead chicken smell has been in my car. He said, well, that's because it's still cold out, ma'am. So I'm here and um, he said, at this point, ma'am, you need more than just your carpet shampoo because the smell is throughout the car. We need to do the seats also. I'm like, yeah, that's fine. He said, you know, if you add on another something, we can do the something and the something. And I was like, oh, yeah, okay. So to my children, I have a $220 bill I need to go pay for. Uh, they're going to do a complete detail on 2 Timothy. You know, this car, I name all my cars Timothy. And this one here is 2 Timothy. Why? Because I still had Timothy when God blessed me with this one. And so... Yeah. So he said, I tell you what I'm going to do, ma'am. How about I just go ahead and spray it down first with some air freshener? And it made such a difference. So I'm here. I'm at the car wash. We're going to get the dead chicken smell out of my car. And I just give God the glory for this day. Um, I wanted to come and share with you. I think on Tuesday, I started sharing the story of the raw chicken that I left in my car on Saturday or Friday and did not discover it until Tuesday. Uh, yeah, because it was frozen Friday evening. It was frozen, I guess, Saturday. Um, yeah, by Sunday, I wasn't smelling anything. Well, Sunday, I had fresh cooked food in the car, so I was basking in the smell of that but still wondering what happened to my chicken i had eight only got seven and i thought i had only gotten seven out of the freezer and put in the car but no so i didn't go to my car monday but when i went tuesday morning man oh man so we're about to get a complete detail and i just wanted to share that with you all on this glorious saturday morning and remember, this is the day which the Lord has made, and we will rejoice, and we're going to be glad in it. So I just wish you a restful Saturday. I know most have a busy Sunday planned, and so I pray that you're able to um, get your rest in. Last night, I saw the woman king, and I'm saying, speak Jesus, speak Jesus. Uh, it's a great warrior movie. I believe men and women, children alike will all enjoy it. So you all take care and God bless you. And I, when I tell you Viola Davis did that, she did that. Well, she always does that for all of her roles. But I tell you, just everyone, just exceptional. All right. So, yeah, they getting ready to pull Second Timothy. Oh, Lord, they still vacuuming out Second Timothy. Because y'all know I be having a lot of stuff going on in my car. But we just thank God that it's going to look good as new today. So to my children, if y'all want to hit your mama up to help her pay her $220 bill, y'all know how to zell me or cash at me. The choice is yours. I'm out, y'all. Deuces.